Don't buy garlic and ginger never again without knowing this. You knew that you could harness the power of nature from the comfort of your home, to grow some of your own food. The good news in this video we will tell you how you can grow garlic and ginger, is incredible. And the best thing is that you can do it by following these tips that are very simple, without needing a large garden and no longer need to go to the supermarket for these two foods that are wonderful. Let's see how you should do it. How can you grow your own ginger? There is a misconception that ginger is a root, when in fact it is a rhizome, think of it as a kind of subterranean stem that ends up expanding roots above the soil line while it has buds. That is why it is so easy to grow ginger, every small gingerbread has the potential to begin to be the basis of a promising new ginger plant. To start a ginger plant, ideally have a ginger root that already has a rhizome sprouting. Most ginger sellers usually pull out shoots to make the product look fresher. So you have to do a search of all the roots of your supermarket until you find one that already has an outbreak or looks like it will sprout. Ginger really requires very little care to grow, you just need to give it the right conditions needed to thrive. Because it is a tropical plant, they need to enjoy humid environments and warm temperatures. After you have selected your piece, trim the areas that look like they are about to start a rhizome as they are the key to growing new ginger plants. After planting the ginger, make sure your rhizome is pointing up so it has room to grow. Always make sure that the pot is of good quality soil and rich in nutrients. Beyond that, make sure it does not dry out and everything should work out fine. Use the plant in a humid and warm place. If you are living far from the Ecuador line, you should not worry. Kitchens and bathrooms are the perfect home environment to make ginger thrive. After 10 months, I should be able to harvest the ginger. Be sure to save a rhizome for the next batch. Store the harvested ginger in a dry, cool drawer. How can you grow your own garlic? Beyond garlic lacking its own rhizome, it is still very simple to plant and harvest at home. Instead of looking for a suitable place, all you have to do with garlic is to wait. Garlic inevitably begins the growth of its own small green shoot. In supermarkets, when garlic has sprouts, they are always removed to make them appear fresher. Step by step, before you plant the garlic, be sure to choose the tooth that has the largest bud. Locate it under about 3 inches of dirt. Always make sure that the soil stays moist, but does not overwater, since excess water could cause the garlic to rot. The optimal time for the cultivation of garlic is around the month of October. It should be ready for the summer harvest, when its leaves turn yellow. After the garlic harvest, be sure to store it in a dark, cool place to prevent mold growth. It should last at least 4 months. Already, you can already enjoy your own endless supply of these two great foods for life. These small indications can generate great benefits to the health of your whole family. If you like the video and you think it can help you, I invite you to give it a like, share the video with your friends and subscribe to my channel, so you don't miss any videos. Here you have other videos that may interest you.